Welcome back to Wiring Products. On this episode, we are going to work with non-insulated butt splices. These are tin plated copper. They can be soldered or crimped. And today we're going to crimp them. These are 18 to 22 gauge. These are 16 to 14 gauge. And these are 12 to 10 gauge. I'm going to use the 1614 gauge. I'm going to strip my wire. Strip each side when you splice, when you're doing a splice, you have to take the wire off both sides. Something else that I wanted to say about these is there is a seam on it. So you put your wire into it and really pay attention to where that seam is. When you're looking at your crimpers, you have to look where that bump is coming down. You do not want to crimp that bump down on that seam. You want the bump on your crimper to be on the other side. And then you squeeze. Okay. And that's good. And you stick the other side in. Again, make sure that the bump is on the opposite side of where that seam is. And then squeeze down. Okay. And there you go. The dimple is going to be on the opposite side of where the seam is. That way it does not split on you. Now I'm going to pull everything in. So you can see the red light, my switch that I just wired up. I'm going to give it juice, turn on my switch, and there you go. And that is how you splice wire together using a non-insulated butt splice. For information on this product and many others, come to wiringproducts.com.